A tired dog is not a good dog. <laughs> I've had many people, and I, I see this on the little memes and stuff on Facebook all the time. A tired dog is a good dog. No, they're just exhausted. They're too tired to do anything else. But when they wake back up, and find themselves bored again, they're going to be right back into mischief or the state of mind that leads them down an inappropriate path, right? It's all about fixing the state of mind with these guys. And yes, exercise is part of it, but let's say you have an aggressive dog that wants to bite people or bite other dogs or whatever, and you work that dog to the point of fatigue. Have you done anything that changes how he perceives strangers or other animals? No, you've just made him too tired in that moment to care about it. But what you're also doing is building a better athlete. So remember, when, when we create um, uh, athletic activities, Stamina, endurance, muscle, it all gets better, <laughs> right? We build um, better athletes through exercise. Well, now what? Now I've got a, an aggressive athlete. That's not a good combo. It's not a good combo for the dog that has not fixed the state of mind and the handler that has not stepped into solid leadership. So yes, I want you to, I want you to do the physical exercise with your dog, 100%. I want you to work them. I want you to do what they were bred to do. I want them to be well exercised, but you have to fix the state of mind. And that only happens with obedience training, problem solving, showing them a better choice to make, a better decision, giving them a clear yes and no guidance, and you to be consistent and capable in your own leadership skills.